a very good morning to all of you my dear friends this is shafiq ahmed and you are all welcome to your favorite youtube channel let's learn together so uh, my student metamorphic rocks are formed because of the high temperature and pressure which is beneath the earth अर्थ के नीचे बहुत सारे हाई प्रेशर है आपको पता है प्रेशर भी है और हीट भी है एंड बिकॉज ऑफ दिस हाई प्रेशर एंड मोर हीट एंड इवन यू कैन फाइंड हाई टेम्परेचर अब द अर्थ ऑल्सो ऑन द एटमोस्फियर ऑल्सो वी ऑल्सो आर फीलिंग फिफ्टी डिग्री सिक्सटी डिग्री मेनी टाइम्स है ना सो दिस चेंजेस समटाइम इट रेन्स कभी कभी ये क्या हो जाता है अचानक रेन हो जाता है बारिश हो जाता है सो दिस चेंज ऑफ टेम्परेचर वॉट इट विल डू इट विल क्रिएट क्रैक्स क्रैक्स इन द रॉक्स इवन इट क्रैक्स इन द बिल्डिंग्स ऑल्सो और ये सारे क्रैक्स को हम लोग क्या बोलते हैं क्लीवेज वी कॉल इट क्लीवेज माई डियर स्टूडेंट so metamorphic rocks are formed with those cleavage because of those cleavage those rocks are broken once again and they mix with other rocks aur ye rocks kyunki weather condition ke wajah se pressure aur heat ke wajah se change ho jate hain crack ho jate hain unke beech mein to wo crack ho ke toot jate hain and they mix again with the soil or with again igneous rocks or the sedimentary rock ye partly igneous rocks bhi ho sakte hain aur partly sedimentary rocks bhi ho sakte hain then it is a mixture metamorphic rock is a mixture of a new rock ek naya rock ban jata hai igneous rock or sedimentary rocks they mix together and they form a new rock because of the high temperature and high pressure beneath the earth as well as above the earth you know on the surface of the earth so because of these weather condition changes in weather condition changes in the weather changes in the temperature changes in the pressure because of these a new a new rock is formed and you know, that is from that and that particular new rock will be quite different in structure in color in size in chemical properties it will be quite different and it will be a new rock ye bilkul ek naya rock ban jata hai sedimentary aur igneous rock kya ho jate hain toot jate hain kiske wajah se pressure aur heat ki wajah se aur external condition weathering rocks ki wajah se and this brings about what that uh, it brings about a uh, crack in the rock and because of that particular crack the rocks again break in broken down into smaller pieces and then again it mixed with other different type of chemical uh, substances which are available in the channel as well as it mix up so that's create a new formation that's create a new type of rock among that one so that the new rock is quite different in sedimentary in structure as well as it is quite different in size and color also and its chemical properties will be quite interesting and changing also so that particular new rock is known as metamorphic rocks my dear students these rocks are very very hard also you can see for example clay or shale changes into slate the clay as well as shale it changes into slate a different type of rock limestone changes into marble and you can see granite can change into gneiss sandstone sandstone changes into quartzite these are the different examples my dear students where you will have to find it out coal changes into graphite and that graphite you are using in your pencil also you know for writing work so coal changes into graphite sand changes into quartzite granite changes into gneiss these are the examples of metamorphic rocks because of this formation a new type of rock is formed and that type of new type of rock is quite changes you know it is a really new rock and it can be a mixture of what igneous as well as sedimentary rocks and this type of metamorphic rocks can be found throughout the earth and you know, throughout the crust of the earth it can be found everywhere you can't say that it is quite it will be found in any particular position only okay then uh, my dear students once again i am going to cycle my dear students now i am going to explain you also in detail that what is it really let me bring that image back you know, so that i can show you that uh, how the rock cycle is going on let me show you with the help of this image first image yeah over here uh, what is the that is the first image you can see over here and now i'm going to zoom it out the first formation as we know that igneous rock is also the primary rock and that really formed that is the first one right? that igneous rocks is formed with the help of magma and when the magma comes out of the uh, surface on the on the surface of the earth it becomes extrusive igneous rocks now this igneous rocks because of wind and rain that i showed you uh, because of weathering condition also these igneous rocks are transported from one place to another you can see uh, let me show you with my marker also uh over here let me show you 
yeah from here you can see over here my students magma is coming out on the surface of the earth and it is changing into rock by uh, by cooling down when it comes on the surface of the earth those magma becomes lava and lava is used to cool down and those cooling down of rocks becomes known as igneous rock that is extrusive igneous rock now because these igneous rocks are carried away because of uh, wind and rain and uh, uh, high blow of the rain also so these are carried on transported deposited and and it is known as sediments when it is deposited to other places into small fragments they are known as sediments and after what lithification that is the process it takes a lot of years to become sedimentary rocks those sediments are changed into sedimentary rocks now again these sedimentary rocks due to metamorphism and you know, it goes also inside the earth also and it because of the uh, heat and pressure of the earth inside the earth over the earth also these sedimentary rocks can also change into different new rock that we have just studied about the metamorphic rock so these sedimentary rocks as well as igneous rocks can take a new form and change into a new rock known as metamorphic rock now these metamorphic rocks when it reaches to the inside of the earth it again melts down because there is a heat and pressure always there inside the earth also then metamorphic rocks is again changing into magma and you know that when magma again comes out on the surface of the earth it again after cooling down it will again become what igneous rock and the process goes on like this one in a cyclic manner and this cyclic manner of uh, cyclic manner of formation of the different form of rocks from one rock to another is known as known as rock cycle my dear students let me show you with the help of another image there is one more image here you can see over here you know, this magma is changing into igneous rock over here you can see and igneous rocks changing into sediments because of the wind and the rain as well as the evaporation of washer also so igneous rock is changing into sediments and this sediments is changing into sedimentary rock over here mean it takes a lot of years thousands of years also it can take to change into sedimentary rock and now sedimentary rocks due to heat and pressure of the earth it can have cracks on this particular sedimentary rocks and those cracks can break it down those broken rocks are again changed into metamorphic rock and that metamorphic rock might be a very new one in the physical structure in the chemical composition as well as size also and color also this metamorphic rock will again when it will reach beneath the earth it will go inside the earth it will become it will melt because of what why it will melt it will be held because of high temperature inside the earth 5000 to 6000 degree centigrade we learned and around 4400 degree centigrade it can found in the mantle also and around 1100 degree centigrade celsius is it is also found on the crust also so these again will become magma and magma will again become igneous rock so this cycle is gone goes on throughout the life of the rock so this cycle is known as rock cycle my dear students so that is all about the rock cycle that i told you now what are the steps if you someone asked you that what are the steps of the rock cycle here is it for you we already know when the molten magma cools it solidifies it become igneous rock and the molten magma is changing into igneous rock igneous rocks are breaking down into small particles and transported to other places known as and changing into different type of rock known as sedimentary and both igneous and sedimentary rocks when it becomes when when it comes in contact with heat and pressure it change it it break down and it also changes into metamorphic rock again weight of coffee rocks which will again get under heat and pressure will melt down and will become will become molten magma and we all know that magma when it comes out it becomes lava and it comes cools down and again forming these rocks so here is the cycle of the rock cycle my dear students now uh, let me uh, let me ask you a few questions also let us continue to our next topic and what is our next topic that is that will be also quite interesting my dear students and uh, that is our next topic let me move why it is not working it's hang out okay how are rocks useful to us rocks hamare liye kaise istemal kar sakte hain how is it useful very good one and what what type of image can you see over here on your screen that the image of taj mahal the taj mahal of agra has been made with the white marble that is also one of the uses of rock ye bhi ek rock ka istemal hai na patthar ka istemal hai ki taj mahal jaisa cheez bana hai that is one of the seven wonders of the world that we are having in our country india so taj mahal is also one of the example that how rocks can be most useful hai na kitna acha istemal hai rocks ka let me show you another image aap dekhen aur can you identify this image ये फोटो कहाँ का है कौन सा इमेज है कैन यू आइडेंटिफाई यस यू आर राइट द इमेज इज फ्रॉम द रेड फोर्ट ऑफ दिल्ली 
एंड इट इज मेड अप ऑफ यू कैन सी रेड सैंड स्टोन ये किससे बना है रेड सैंड स्टोन से बना है ये इमेज लेट मी शो यू दैट वर्ड है ना नाउ अब देखते हैं नेक्स्ट इमेज नेक्स्ट फोटोग्राफ क्या है that will be quite interesting that is the fatehpur sikri near agra made of what again sandstone dekh sakte hain aap it is also made up of sandstone that is also one of the uses of rocks my dear students now dekho aap ye pehchan rahe hain can you identify this one this image yes you are right this is the dilwara temple of mount abu that is in rajasthan and it is also made up of marble that is also one of the uses of the rocks my dear student that is the use of rock now let me see whether you can identify the next image or not Can you identify this image? क्या आप पहचान सकते हैं ये फोटो कहाँ का है Yes, you are right. That Jaisalmer Fort of Rajasthan. Jaisalmer Fort है ये राजस्थान में और ये कौन से स्टोन से बना है It is made up of yellow limestone. Very good. So that is also one of the uses of rocks. अब आप देखें आपको ये क्या पहचान रहे हैं आप That is how can can you identify this image? ये क्या फोटो देख सकते हैं Yes, right. You're all right. The rock cut temple of Odisha, made of igneous rocks such as charnosite and granite. Charnosite or granite igneous rocks are made. It is made of rock. The rock cut temple in Odisha. Odisha is made of rock. The rock cut temple. And another rock cut temple in Tamil Nadu. Mein bhi hai. And here is the image. It is also made up of charnosite and granite. That is igneous rock. That is also one of the uses of rock, my dear students. Are you seeing the rock cut temple of Tamil Nadu also? let me show you more images can you identify this one this is a stone house the house is made up of on stone pure patthar ka bana hua ye ghar hai that is also one of the uses of stone that we can build our houses also with the help of stone hai na patthar se bhi aap ghar bana sakte hain and in previous earlier years people were living citizens or most of the human beings were living in stone house only hai na pehle zamane mein log पत्थर के घरों में रहा करते थे यू कैन सी ऑल्सो वन ऑफ द यूजेस ऑफ स्टोन पत्थर से रोड भी बनता है ना द रोड कैन ऑल्सो बी बिल्ड विद हेल्प ऑफ स्टोन यू कैन सी ओवर ईयर आप देख सकते हैं इमेज में रोड आर ऑल्सो मेड ऑफ ऑफ हार्ड रॉक्स यू कैन सी ओवर ईयर और देखते हैं और क्या यूजेस है रॉक्स का लेटेस्ट सी द हार्ड रॉक्स आर यूज फॉर मेकिंग रोज हाउस बिल्डिंग डेट आई शोड यू ऑल टाइप ऑफ मेटेरियल बिल्डिंग मेटेरियल फॉर पेविंग रोड बिल्डिंग वॉल्स और फॉइजेस स्ट्रक्चर्स ऑल कम्स फ्रॉम रॉक जितने भी घर हम लोग बनाते हैं बिल्डिंग बनाते हैं ब्रिज बनाते हैं रोड बनाते हैं सारे रॉक्स के ही आता है कोई किसी ना किसी टाइप का रॉक होता है वो लाइम स्टोन सेडिमेंट्री रॉक इज यूज मेनली इन द मैन्युफेक्चर ऑफ सीमेंट लाइम स्टोन से क्या बनाते हैं हम लोग सीमेंट बनाते हैं अब यू नो हाउ इम्पोर्टेंट इज सीमेंट शेल सेडिमेंट्री रॉक है जिससे हम लोग थीन बेड्स बनाते हैं ना वी यूज स्टोन इन मेनी गेम्स बहुत सारे गेम्स भी खेलते हैं हम लोग स्टोन से सच एस पिट्ठू पिट्ठू गेम देखा आपने नहीं देखा है तो देखा देते हैं आपको पिट्ठू गेम कैसे होता है ये भी पत्थर से लोग खेलते हैं बच्चे खेलते हैं अपने बचपन में पिट्ठू गेम देखा होगा आपने पत्थर को खड़ा कर कर ऐसे बॉल से मारते हैं दिस गेम ने इज नोन एज पिट्ठू गेम और एक गेम होता है हॉप स्कॉच हॉप स्कॉच यानी कित कित लड़कियों को देखा होगा आपने खेलते हुए है ना ये देख रहे हैं आप कुछ बच्चे खेल रहे हैं है ना लड़के होप डेट यू हैव लाइक द वीडियो एंड वी विल वेट अगेन इन आवर नेक्स्ट वीडियो रिलीज of the tutorial and if you are new to this channel please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get the information of the next release of the tutorial please share it with your friends and others also thank you for the time being take care stay at home bye bye